welcome to another video. So I recently did a cleaning video that was basically just my weekly cleaning routine and a lot of you seem to like it so I decided to do a video kind of similar to that. Today we're going to be going through my closet and cleaning it and organizing it which really needs to be done. A lot of us are staying at home now and I just think this is a really great opportunity to go through stuff, do some spring cleaning, air it out. And before we get started I wanted to let you guys in on a little coin making secret because I know a lot of us would like to make money from our closet besides just like selling clothes. So today I've partnered with Shop My Style, which is basically a way that you guys can make money without actually having to buy clothes to then sell. Shop My Style is a feature of an app which I will link down below. Basically you download the app and then you just start browsing your favorite stores and as you're browsing and clicking on different things, it automatically updates on your boutique storefront. You choose your storefront name and then you basically just share your storefront link, you know, on Instagram, on Twitter, all your social media sites and people can start clicking and you start getting paid. So Shop My Style is a part of every sale. Every sale is a must have shopping app that basically shows you everything that is on sale in your size across over 120 different stores. You literally just put in your sizes and then you can just start browsing as you normally would. Everything that it shows you is on sale and it's all in your size. I know how frustrating it is to like go to a sale section, you find something really bomb and it's like sold out in your size. So this really takes away from that problem. And then with their new feature, Shop My Style, you can essentially make money on everything that you've been browsing and clicking on and looking at and not just stuff that you've bought, but just like stuff that you've just been interested in. I just think this is a great app to have because first of all, it's just so convenient that you get to see everything on sale in your size. And also it's just a great way, you know, if you're gonna be shopping or browsing online anyway, you might as well make some extra coin from it. That's definitely a huge way that influencers make money and it's cool that now it's just so accessible for anyone to do. Let's get on to the closet organization. So this is my closet before and I honestly don't think it's like the messiest thing in the world, but I just find that I always, like I've always had this problem since I was little. I just hate getting rid of stuff. Like I just feel like there's been so many times where I'm like, I regret getting rid of something and whatever so i guess in like to try and combat that i do try to put a lot of stuff on poshmark um and that's also part of this mess is you know there's like some stuff that's already listed and then there's some stuff that i have yet to post so it's just kind of like bags of stuff as well as like okay i still need to go through stuff so it's kind of cluttered so anyway i just decided to basically take everything out and then also just like this area does get very dusty and whatnot so i definitely wanted to dust and vacuum and just do all that because since everything's like on the floor all the time <laughs> i don't often come in and vacuum so here as you can see i'm just literally taking everything out i don't take like everything everything out but you know all the stuff that is basically on the floor all the stuff that's cluttered and all the clothes that are not hanging up so yeah basically the goal today is just to kind of sort through stuff and again clean like get rid of the dust vacuum and just try to make it appear more organized my apartment unit is actually really interesting in the sense that this is my only closet space so it's like cool i have a walk-in closet but it's kind of only to make up for the fact that there's no i'm gonna have like cabinets in my bathroom but i can't like store towels in there like it's li literally just like products um and i don't have a hallway closet so like everything has to go in here like obviously i have like kitchen cabinets and like again bathroom cabinets but they're not really obviously i'm not gonna sort like bath towels in the kitchen but also the bathroom is just like not big enough so um i do have a lot of these little storage units like as you can see this wire little thing as well as all the plastic bins which do help kind of like add some organization when i first was touring this apartment i was like oh my god this closet is like so cool and like it is like blessed grateful but um i've definitely had to learn how to use this space and how to not let it get like so messy i've really found this is actually like probably one of the best things i've learned both with like physical space as well as time it's like you really use how much you have so if i have this big closet i'm gonna use the whole thing and it's like gonna be messy like you think like oh i have so much more space but it's really like you're gonna fill the space no matter what versus if i had a smaller closet i would probably just like make that work as well also with time like you know when you have like 
an assignment due at the end of the month and you literally just like wait the whole month to do it and it's like oh I had all this time but it's like you just get it done in a day versus if you have something due the next day it's like most of the time you're just gonna get it done in that day so that's something I try to think about and it's just kind of a good little like mental hack if you do have something due or you are trying to organize it's like okay how can I just like use this space and kind of keep that in mind um, so this is basically the area of my closet where I store a lot of my clothes that are on Poshmark and because I have stuff that's already listed as well it's just like not all in one space so let me know if you guys want a part two that's not really featured in this video but I would love to show you guys how I organize all that I take my Poshmark very seriously I'm not like you know these fakes that list stuff and like never ship it out like I ship stuff out the next day like I, I've been doing it since like 2015 like I'm very into it. um so anyway I part of what I also noticed is especially with all my tank tops and whatnot they were just all kind of like like multiple tank tops would be on one hanger and it just looked very messy it was hard to find stuff and then I realized like I don't even wear most of these so going through that was also very very just like nice and it just looks better on the rack I'm more likely to wear stuff um, and now I'm just going through my closet basically like uh, putting stuff in different places like where it actually belongs and then going through stuff you know like should I put this on Poshmark should I donate this etc are like any donation places open during this time is that an essential I don't know but if anything you know put it on Poshmark or just store it to drop off after this is all over now I'm just refolding all of my bigger sweatshirts they're up they're up there on the top shelf and they just tend to get very like jumbled up and now i am vacuuming and now time to go through all of these bins and whatnot and just kind of organize stuff again they can really accumulate a lot of like just stuff that they shouldn't so now i'm refolding everything and this is after going through stuff and you know deciding what to get rid of and whatnot hanging up certain things that just like really helps going through the bins like I just feel like I keep so much stuff like I have all these swimsuits that it's like okay like move on or like they're too small but I'm still like hanging on to them like it's just stuff like that also please excuse my patchy tan in the back um you know it's quarantine I don't care as long as I can see it and it looks good in the front it's all, it's all that matters during this time um so yeah also with like old sports bras and stuff like they'll be so old and like gross and like I never wear them because I don't like them anymore like they're like old but I still hang on to them so I really try to like okay let's go through this so it's like you know if it needs to be thrown away throw it away if it needs to be donated like you know just going through stuff and then this one especially holds a lot of just like trash and random stuff so trying to go through that also I did wash all of like my t-shirts you know when you store t-shirts it's like always specifically t-shirts for a long time and they kind of get like a weird smell so I washed all that went through all of that obviously didn't show that but <laughs> now I'm putting it back they're all a little more organized and some of the drawers are even empty now which is so nice it's like oh really didn't need all that space after all um i would love a dresser i just don't really have space for one in this apartment so these storage bins are actually perfect this is around the point where it's not really fun anymore in here it's clean and it looks cute and like way less cluttered but then it's like ah uh, uh, you look at that bed. basically this is all stuff to sort through i'm just like really not in the but then it's like if I take a break, the motivation will be gone. And then I'll just come back to this messy room. So I have to push through. Alexa, play. So I basically ended up just putting all of this stuff into bags. So at least it would be contained. But I still have yet to organize it. So let me know if you guys want to see me going through that. I don't know if that would be interesting or whatnot. If you guys want to see me like fold a bunch of clothes for Poshmark. But let me know. That was basically all I had left to do. It's definitely not perfect. And again, I feel like once I go through all those boxes and bags of clothes, it will feel a lot better. But I would say it's generally more organized and it just feels nicer walking in here. Again, I vacuumed, dusted, so it just is like nicer. And I still, all those boxes at the top are actually for Poshmark orders, which is why I keep those. Um, but yeah, just a little more organization, a little more like vibes. 
a little more just like feeling fresh. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know if you want me to do my makeup organization and clean out next because that also definitely needs it and I have nothing but time on my hands. <laughs> Don't forget to download the app every sale and begin browsing to start getting paid and let me know your shop my style storefront name in a comment below because I will be running a contest on my next video. I would really love to see what you guys have been browsing and what all of your different styles are. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys in my next video.